Growing up, Pete Bell had all the traits that typically define obsessive compulsive disorder. Excessive cleaning and constantly checking and rechecking his movements. Consumed with constant intrusive thoughts, he was stuck in a debilitating cycle of behaviours. No escape is a word I like to use. In a constant state of anxiety. At 38, he was diagnosed with OCD. Five years on, he can now manage his symptoms. Through medication, advances in science, uh, life really did, did start again in a lot of ways. New research is helping him make sense of his own mind. A study by QAMR Berghofer compared brain scans of healthy volunteers and people with OCD. It found an imbalance in signalling pathways deep within the brain is the likely cause of the anxiety disorder. Our study specifically not only replicate what uh, previous work have uh, shown, but it also provides some insight into the mechanism that can be linked to the imbalance between uh, these uh, different brain regions. Researchers will use the study's findings in clinical trials of brain stimulation treatments for OCD this year. Brain stimulation has already proven effective in treating symptoms of depression. They allow us to move forward and uh, try to develop intervention that can restore this imbalance in the brain in a targeted fashion. It's hoped the findings will break down the stigma around OCD too, with the knowledge there's a basis to the behaviour. Kira Jones, ABC News, Brisbane.